Hello again, everyone. Today we'll be talking about experiment six, studying equilibrium. Most of this experiment should be pretty familiar to you, and it should be pretty straightforward for you to move through it. You'll be doing Beer's Law and using the spectrometers as you have in other experiments. Uh, of course, this one's a little bit different because you're measuring things related to chemical equilibrium instead of chemical kinetics. One thing that you'll do in the experiment is change the temperature of the solution, and you'll have a test tube that you'll be moving from an ice water bath to hot water. Just so that we avoid any shattering of test tubes, which can happen if they change temperature too suddenly, when you take your test tube out of the ice water, you'll want to hold it in your hands to warm it up to room temperature before you put it into the hot water bath. Unlike other experiments where each chemical has only been in one concentration, in this experiment there are actually multiple different concentrations of the same chemical. So when you're getting your reagents, you need to make sure that you're getting the correct concentration and the correct chemical. For example, we have some solutions that are dilute, something like 0 0.006 molar or 0 0.0015 molar, and we have other solutions that are concentrated, something like 0.1 molar or 1 molar. Be careful that you're reading both the chemical name and the concentration on the bottles when you're gathering your reagents. That's all for today. Good luck!